is the food from Walmart, their great value brand. Actually better than the top name brand foods. We're about to find out. Cheap Walmart food versus the expensive name brand food. It's usually like two times more expensive, but can you taste the difference if you blindfold yourself and eat both of them side by side? That's what we're doing today. Welcome to Walmart Wednesday. Good morning. Welcome to the Shane Today Show. Soon to be the number one daily show on YouTube. The S2 Squad, 2,671 subscribers. Members in the squad, I flipping love you guys, man. Sorry for no video yesterday. I filmed it and then I edited it and it was just bad. It, it wasn't good, so I scrapped it. That's what happens on the Change of Day show sometimes. I gotta go hit up Walmart. I'm gonna get five foods, five rounds. Let's see what they got. Hello, I'm at Walmart for literally the third day in a row. We're in the same clothes, so. Woo! Welcome to the Walmart cheap versus expensive food battle arena. Here we go. Got five foods from Walmart. There's a great value version, which is the cheap Walmart brand versus the top name brand version of the same food. Five rounds, one blindfold. Can you actually taste the difference between cheap versus expensive foods? Will the Walmart food taste better in any of these rounds? We're about to find out. Here we go. I asked you guys on Instagram what foods you wanted to see me try for this. And it was so close. The poll was so close. It was like 30% each pretty much. So I got all of them. Round one, Walmart Great Value Ketchup versus Heinz Ketchup. The Great Value, let's see. The Heinz Ketchup was $3 for 20 ounces. The Great Value was 98 cents. Seven cents an ounce versus 15 cents an ounce. So yeah, over twice as expensive for the Heinz. But is it better? I got two plates, I'm putting W, for Walmart and I'm putting a star. I should probably just put a money sign. We'll put the money sign for the for the hive. My room's gonna smell like ketchup all day now. Nice. <laughs> Warm ketchup. I love it. Oh dude, it looks like barbecue sauce. Yes, it looks that brown in person. Oh, all over my white tablecloth. Nice! Heinz is significantly more red, which I'm gonna pop up on the screen. Which one is which? We're gonna mix them around. Which ketchup is gonna taste the best? Let's find out. Here we go. Let's mix them up a little bit. Here we go. No, I do not have french fries uh, or anything. All I have is a spoon. Ketchup number one. Ah, it's flipping sour a little bit. That's got me. Ketchup number two. That is ketchup. This is not ketchup. This has to be Walmart. Tastes like baby food mixed with barbecue sauce. This is bad. <laughs> but let's see. Yeah, this is Walmart, right? Yeah, dude, I don't know what this is. It's not even close, man. It's not even close. Ah! Is it worth paying two times more for the Heinz ketchup? A hundred percent. Yeah, I would pay three times more. <laughs> Let's move on to the chips. Walmart great value salsa chips versus Tostitos. I got Totino's pizza rolls and Tostitos. Tostitos chips. Tostitos chips were $4.38. Great value. $2.24. About twice as expensive. Wait, this says $5.99 on this bag. <laughs> I paid $4.38. Uh, maybe they were on sale. I don't know what's going on. Here we go. Dollar sign. Tostitos. W for Walmart. I do have salsa right here. Tostitos. Chips. Walmart. Great value chips. I'm predicting the Walmart chips are gonna win this one just because there can't really be that much of a difference, right? I mean, tortilla chips and salsa? Like, there's just no way, right? I mean, maybe. Maybe there's a huge difference. Chip number one. Oh, I love this salsa, by the way. It's Tostito Salsa. So. Let me try one without the salsa. Tastes like a chip, man. This one's just gonna have to blow my mind to say there's any huge difference here. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Wow. These 
are way saltier. Is that a good thing though? I don't know if it's good. I have no clue which one is which. I'm going, I'm gonna go with, uh, I'm gonna go with the less salty ones. If you're eating, if you're eating it with salsa, it doesn't matter at all. This, these are the, these are the winner for me. I still don't know. They look exactly the same. Walmart, Walmart chip versus Tostitos. I think these are the same chips. Save the money. Walmart, taking round two all day. I'm putting a bunch of pictures on Instagram right now. I'm gonna take a picture of each of them and you guys like put it on my story and you guys vote for which one you think, which one you think is the name brand. Cause they really look, each one pretty much looks the same, but I did that last week and 70% of you guys guessed the wrong Lucky Charms. Like you thought the Walmart one was the real Lucky Charms. Walmart Great Value Frosted Flakes versus Kellogg's Actual Frosted Flakes. I can't believe they're both literally called Frosted Flakes. How is that allowed? I have no idea. Here we go, which one tastes better? Polar Bear as the mascot on the Frosted Flakes, which makes a lot more sense than a tiger, I do have to say. No, I do not have any bowls, so we're gonna use a cup. Here we go, fill her up. Walmart Frosted Flakes right there. I'm not gonna lie, probably my favorite cereal, Frosted Flakes. I haven't had it in a while though, like it used to be my favorite. Oh man. Frosted Flakes, right off the bat, Kellogg's flakes are eh, probably like definitely bigger. Milk, 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 go in. Let me take a picture for IG. Man, these look so similar. I don't know how I'm gonna tell which one is which because I'm not gonna write on these cups. I guess I'll put them on plates. This is what you get on the Shane Today Show, man. You just wake up and film something and whatever happens, happens. Here we go. If the Walmart Frosted Flakes taste better than actual Frosted Flakes, my whole life, is gonna be a lie. I mean, I grew up eating Frosted Flakes probably every single day, multiple times a day. I think I got down like to eating one box a day when I, you know, we're just gonna, we're just gonna leave it at that. Uh, all right, cup number one, the polar bear versus the tiger. I have an idea in my mind already. Let's see what this one can bring. I have eaten so many Frosted Flakes in my life. That's the only reason I'm confident about this answer. I am 99% sure. Although, let me just say, they don't taste that different. These ones are thinner, I think, and like a little sweeter, but it's not too sweet. It's like, these are Frosted Flakes. I would bet so, I would guarantee it that these are the flipping Tiger. I'm gonna say the prices right after this. These ones are honestly not as sweet in like a good way, but it's barely different. Let's see. Come on. These are frosted, man. I can already, I can see it. Walmart! No, no, no. Did I mix up the cups? No, nah, these are Frosted Flakes. No, I don't even know anymore. They taste exactly the same now that I'm tasting them again. Uh, great value, Frosted Flakes, $1.93. Regular Frosted Flakes, $3.98. Walmart wins, round three. Round four, Totino's Pizza Rolls versus Walmart Great Value Pizza Rolls. The Walmart ones, I microwave both of them. Totino's looks like probably twice as full. These just look like flat pillows. The great value, but maybe they taste better. I don't know about this. <laughs> I mean, $5.66. Wow, for 50. The Walmart ones were $3.83 for 40. About 10 cents a pizza roll versus 11 cents. They're almost the same price? They're almost the same price, apparently, if I did that math right. All right, let's put the Totino's over here. Walmart ones over here the Walmart ones look sad I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put it nicely can Walmart compete in the pizza roll game with the big dog Totino's which I always thought it was Tostino's or something but it's Totino's 
Totitos? Totinos. Who knows? Let's find out. Because they look and feel a lot different, I'm using the snack div to pick them up. So I hopefully won't know which one's which, even though I still possibly could. This is hard when you're blindfolded. Here's one. Very cheesy. Way too much bread. Those are not great. Well, drop that one. <laughs> Did he just land on the plate? It explodes in your mouth. Pepperoni is so strong. Guys, it's not even close. You can't even taste pepperoni in this one. This is Walmart. I'm spending the extra three cents per pizza roll to eat Totitos. We're tied up two to two, going into the final round. Here we go. Any moms out there, do not go the cheap route with those pizza rolls, please. Totitos, so much better. It was, I mean, that's the furthest one off so far in two videos that we've done. So, the final round. Here we go. I plan for the pizza rolls to be the final round, but I did it out of order, and that's what we do on the Shane Today Show. So, here we go. One of these cups of coffee is Walmart coffee. Great value for $4, what was it? $4.24 for 12, 35 cents a cup of coffee. One of these cups, this one, is Dunkin' coffee, which was $16.88 for 22 of them. Why did they put 22 in the box? I'm not sure, which is 77 cents a cup almost it's twice as expensive this is almost a dollar a cup this is almost a quarter for one cup of coffee the final round tiebreaker duncan versus walmart coffee walmart is two to two right now the Bengals white cup is duncan the joe burrow with all his pictures on it is walmart i believe i honestly might not know anymore but <laughs> if you guys like this video man i'm here every single day we're doing the daily show i'm trying to do every single day the number one daily show on youtube we're just beginning so join the s2 squad today and help found be a founding member of what is to be the number one show on the internet very soon coffee number one it smells like gasoline this one kind of smells like chocolate not sure not sure all right here we go Okay. I love Dunkin' so much that if I pick the Walmart coffee here, I'm gonna be so sad. Guys, I'm not gonna lie to you, man. This one kind of just tastes like water. This one tastes like a coffee you would get in like an office building or like, a, like those car mechanic shops that have the coffee and you get it in that little white styrofoam cup. That's what this tastes like. This one, I can't... They're both bad. I'm just gonna say it. They're both bad. Neither of them are great. I'm pretty sure I know which one's Duncan, but I don't know. I don't think, I don't think it's better. And I'm sad. This one, I would rate a four. This one, I would rate a three out of 10. I think this is Walmart. Duncan! What are we doing? It just doesn't taste like anything, man. This one tastes like a car, tastes like I'm getting an oil change. <laughs> but it tastes like something. Walmart wins for the second week in a row. Comment ideas for next Walmart Wednesday. What foods or like lotions or something you want to see. Love you guys. See you tomorrow.